If you're not looking like a glazed donut before you go to bed, what are you doing? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Jalea Chin here. And I am here today with a skincare routine. In this video, I am going to show you guys my nighttime skincare routine. Nighttime right now, so I'm giving you guys nighttime skincare routine. Skincare routine. My daytime skincare routine. My daytime skincare routine is also the same, but there's like one or two or like three different products I use. So if you guys want like a morning routine, skincare routine, let me know, comment down below. But this is a nighttime skincare routine, okay? Let me just make this disclaimer. This video is not sponsored. I'm not getting paid. I'm simply just putting you guys on. I'm not gonna get heat. I'm putting you guys on. So. If you are struggling with dark spots or like hyperpigmentation on your face, keep watching because I used to have a lot of dark spots on my face. I, I'm telling you guys, every time I got a bump, I would pop it and the pop would turn into a scar, which would leave a dark spot on my face. And I still have a couple, like, I don't know if you guys can see, but I'll, I'll insert photos if I have any. But yeah, I'm gonna show you guys how, no, I'm gonna show you guys what products I use to get rid of that. And I'm just gonna give you guys like a nighttime skincare routine that I do before I go to bed. So, I just came from work, so this is my skin. Um, and what we're gonna do first is we're going to cleanse. So first I'm gonna put on my little cute headband, cause you know, like, like Let's take a moment for the pajamas. I have on a juicy couture pajama set. And look how cute. Look how cute. It says juicy bedazzled. You can't tell me this isn't a cute pajama set. Like, come on. So I'm gonna put on my headband. Oh God. This is my headband that I wear when I'm simply just lounging around house or when I'm doing skincare so yeah even though my forehead looks really big right now or is it just always big I don't know anyways let's get into it so first things first as I said we're gonna cleanse first um I like to double cleanse in the night that's just like my thing because I feel like my face becomes really dirty with like all the bacteria and stuff on it so I only double cleanse in the night, in the morning, I use one cleanser because I don't have time. We're gonna go in with our Corks Low pH Good Morning Gel Cleanser. I use this in the morning and night, just depending on, but yeah. Oh okay, yeah, so this is the first cleanser I use, and I just use this to take off, like, I have on a little bit of mascara, so I just use this to take off, like, the first layer of any type of bacteria or, like, sweat, residue on my face so this is the second cleanser that i use from the amore k and this is with all natural ingredients in it I usually like to use this as my second cleanser because I'll leave it on my face for like a minute to two minutes so that really really works and I usually just exfoliate and let it sit there and yeah all right so now that my face is all clean this is what I'm looking like these are the dark spots that I was actually referring to so they're fading slowly but yeah this is my skin with nothing on it First step, when I finish double cleansing for the night, I go in with my toner, and this is the toner that I use. I use the Ordinary Gly Glycolic Acid 7%. And y'all, let me tell you, this stuff is very strong, so I only use it in the nighttime because in the morning, you can't wear it with sunscreen. Like, oh. I, I guess it'll irritate your skin, but it literally tells you on the instructions like to ideally use it in the PM. 
So I use it in the nighttime and it's just like a toner that is supposed to like balance your skin tone so it gets rid of like hyperpigmentation and dark spots and I think it's been working. I've been using it since September I think but I think it's been working so yeah. If you want to purchase this, purchase at your own risk. If you have sensitive skin, I don't know if I would get this but if you don't have sensitive skin, this is a really good toner for the nighttime. Okay, so I'm gonna put some on my face. Okay. Just pat that in. But yeah, unpopular opinion, like I do not use cotton swabs to put on any base products because I don't know, I just hate the feeling of cotton swab, so I just use my hands. If you want, you could use a cotton swab to pat this on your face, but I don't, personally. And yeah, I'll just put it in and literally let your skin dry. Let your skin dry before you move on to the next step. Always let your skin dry, okay? So yeah, this is the toner. And now we're gonna go in with another toner that I use. I only use this in the nighttime as well. I actually got this from Marshalls and it's a brightening facial serum with vitamin C. I also use this for my dark spots and to just balance my skin. So I'm just gonna put some, just put like three pumps and once again, pat in my skin. I'm gonna do this like so. Or rub it in. Pat or rub. And then just let it dry. So this is what our skin is looking like with just two toners on. I think it looks pretty good, but anyways. Next, I go in with my snail mucin, and this is basically just to hydrate my skin. Um, so I don't Sometimes I use it, sometimes I don't. I usually use it in the daytime though, but sometimes I don't use it every night, but tonight I'll put it on. So I literally just like two pumps and I rub it together. And yeah, this brand is really good. Like I like all of their products and it's Korean based, so yeah. And it just leaves my skin really like smooth. Like my, like, literally like a baby's butt. Smooth. Like look how smooth. And it just leaves me so smooth, so hydrated. Look at how smooth my face looks. Yeah. It's very good for hydration and like just a smooth, like, oh. So yeah, this is really good. I recommend a thousand percent. I'm gonna go in with my serum. It's my Neomora K serum. And this is a dark spot remover serum. I, most of my products have to do with dark spots because that was my struggle way back when, but we've made progress. So yeah, this is a natural, all natural ingredient. It literally has like aloe vera, um, just a whole bunch of stuff I'm not gonna read right now. But yeah, this is all natural and I like it because I feel like it really works and it really like brightens up my skin. So I just take this and plop it on each cheek. And like you don't need a lot because a lot of it comes out. And I'm just gonna do the same thing and rub it in. Like that. My dark spots. Like they're really starting to fade. And then let it dry. But those are all the serums I do, so we can go step by step. First we cleanse, first we double cleanse, then we do our serums, and now we're gonna do our moisturizer, okay? We're on to moisturizers now. So, for moisturizers, I like to use, I use anything really, but for my nighttime moisturizers, I use Youth to the People. And this is like their sample size because I got this for my birthday from Sephora. 
So this is their Superfood Air Whip Moisturizer Cream. And I mean like, I don't have anything bad to say about it. It's pretty good. It's like literally almost done guys. And I just like wipe it on my face. That, that, rub it in. Yeah, so this is just like a moisturizer to just make sure my face doesn't dry out after all the serums I put on. This is just moisturizing my face. And yeah, nothing bad to say about that. Like, it just locks in all the moisturizer. I mean, all the serums I used. And then for my other moisturizing step, I have Cervi Skin Renewing Night Cream. And honestly, I got this in Jamaica. I don't really know what it does, but it's just a renewing night cream. I just got it in Jamaica and I was like, why not? So for this, I just put it like where my dark spots are, so like right here. Whoa, that's a lot. And I'll put some on my cheek over here. Yikes, I might have put too much. And I just rub it in. And yeah. It's like a a night moisturizer, I guess you could say. Whereas this one you can use in the day or night. This is specifically just for night. Okay, so now we're on to our last step of the night, our oils. So I like to put oil on my face when I go to bed because when I put oil before I go to bed, I'll be waking up like my face is so soft. So I'm going to show you the two oils that I use. This is the Ordinary Organic Rosehip Seed Oil. And honestly guys, I don't really know what this does, but it be doing something. It's a regular face oil. And I like it. I just put, I try not to put too much because I don't want to be too oily. Just put like a dash and a dash and rub it in. Like so. And yeah, it just leaves my skin looking like that. I'm telling you, every time I go to bed, I look like I just came out of the gym because I'd be looking so sweaty, but it's really just my skincare. It's the funniest thing ever. And then for my last step, I use um, Simplicity Body and Mind. So this is a skin conditioning face oil and basically it's all natural ingredients and it's black owned. Yeah, and this is just for like dark, you can use it for dark spots, you can use it for like a moisturizer, you can use it for anything really. I just like to put it on my dark spots before I go to bed. So just on this side of my cheek, just here, like I literally just put it like where my spots are. And rub it in, like so. Those were my oils that I used to basically just lock in all the moisturizer and serums that I've put on my face so far. And now for my final, 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 final step of the skincare routine, my dry lips. I use Vaseline, okay? You guys could never force me to pay $20 for a lip sleeping mask. Like, and this is no shade to, Lin to Laneige, but Vaseline is the OG. Vaseline is the OG. I don't care about Aquaphor or Laneige or Summer Fridays. Vaseline has never done me wrong. I just put Vaseline on my lips. My lips are moisturized when I go to bed. And baby, that's it. You're done. Like, if you're not looking like a glazed donut before you go to bed, what are you doing? Your time routine is not it. You need to change it. Mmm. Like, look at me. I'm literally glowing. Guys, I'm glowing. But yeah, um, all jokes aside, that was my nighttime routine. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Once again, this is these are the products that work for my face. Buy according to what works for your skin or what you think would work for your skin. I'm gonna link all the products in my description box below. That is really it. Like I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's something different. It's not a vlog. And I wanted to film because I actually really love skincare. Like, if I could, I would make my own skincare line. That's how much I love it. 
But yeah, once again, as I was saying, this is not pure. I wish it was. I wish this was a sponsored video, but it's not. So, I'm putting you guys on real stuff. I'm putting you guys on stuff that works for me. And yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment down below if you enjoyed it or if you have any questions about the products I use. Comment down below and also let me know if you want me to do a morning routine. Yeah, this was my nighttime routine. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one.